about to make some food. Typical British weather outside, as you can tell, pretty cold, blue faced. Um, just been out with Toby on a nice little walk and uh, just started running again. So he only got 3,000 steps for his morning walk instead of about nine. Turned around, came back. Now I'm very hungry and I am going to do some oats and protein shake and mix in some pineapple with it this morning. Plans for today, I'll probably try doing some pausing later on and practicing a little bit of pausing. I have to go pick up some supplements um, and a sneaky little ab workout. I'll show some video footage of set ab workout later. Uh, in the video but other than that that is pretty much it nice easy day off i will be learning a little bit more about um final cut which is the, the software i'm currently using and i've also bought premiere pro um a tutorial on premiere pro we use that anyway in the company well we have a license which allows us to use that um so I didn't actually have to buy that, which is good. But other than that, that is all the training. In terms of weight, my weight is now, um, what was I, 192 pounds, which is about 86 kilograms and 13 stone eight for people watching in Europe and things and America. So I'm probably, I think I can probably get down to about 80 kilos for competing. I had a good idea yesterday which I'm going to run by a friend and uh, my uncle who you heard in the previous video which was to do a vlog on sort of amateur to pro so I've never competed in a physique or bodybuilding competition before and I'm toying with the idea of tracking everything on a daily vlog and calling it the road to pro. So if you think that's a good idea Obviously, let us know, give us some feedback, and I will. I'll, I'll give you an update on this by the end of the week, probably, whether or not I'm going to do it. And that's about it. So I've got my uh, well, lunch, breakfast right here. Oh, check it out pineapples, vanilla, protein, and all. I popped to see uh, my mother, see if she was in. Turns out she wasn't. So I got changed. I'm meant to be at the gym for 12. It's sort of my day off today. Um, but my brother isn't ready, he's out with the dogs, so I'm going to see if my friend Stu's in and pop in and say hi to him for a little bit and then come back, pick up my brother and go to the gym. I'm playing badminton later as well and I also have a physio session so this will be interesting. Definitely going to be burning a lot of calories today, just hoping I can sustain but making great progress. Just about knocking Stu's now. In fact, I'll just go in. Hello. Hello. All right. That's Shreddy there. Oh, that's Stu. Oh, looking looking suave, mate. Hello. Thanks, mate. Been for a fresh haircut. I know, mine feels. I feel like a tramp, I find, but I'm styled it, so. Progress looks good. To the best part of the day <sighs> double chicken subway salad just got some gym shark gear through the post i bought this the other day but um 
and two of them are too big. So this is now the return. Oop. Fingers crossed. Um, passes us. Fingers crossed this one fits. That accidentally put into the t-shirt. Almost. That was gross. So we have the Apex t-shirt, like medium and Steveless t shirt as well. So I'll just try one of them on. <clears throat> they both should be similar size and fingers crossed shape. Take this out for now. Is there any more bells? I don't think so. I think that's it. I'm good to go. Much better fitting than the loose Nike top. There we go. Just finished the ab session at the gym with my older brother as well, and that all went nicely. Demolished me subway, that was where I had to stop recording. I was starving. Demolished that, and now, yeah, off back home, walk the dogs, and set myself up for physio later. So I'm busy driving, just left the house, we're going to drive over and do some physio, that'll be interesting. Yeah, so about, well I started this one for aid program and about two weeks in, I started noticing I was getting um, quite severe pain in my elbows. So much so that it was affecting me greatly when I came to the gym and my ability to do any type of um, high intensity lift. So I basically decided to take action and go and speak to, um, well, have a few sports massages, but it's been sort of flared up in the past. I know it's sort of like a tennis or a golfer's elbow, however you would call it. But I knew I had to take action, so that's what I did. I now this is about my third session now, and it's definitely helping. It's clear enough, little by little. But obviously, we've been on such a strict um, routine and sort of diet plan, etc., and training routine. I'm not really wanting to drop that to allow the muscle to recover or the tendons to recover in this case. So I'm just having to sort of try and work around it. So like for instance, today I only trained abs. Tomorrow will probably be a day off to allow my arm to fully rest. By a day off, I mean it'll just be a case of do my spinning in the morning, which is typically 20 minutes, which should, it's usually steady pace, so 20 minutes, of which I'll burn roughly about 20, um, uh, sorry, two calories. And then from there, moving forward, I'd probably take Toby out on a walk. So usually my morning started about 5 a.m., half 5, um, which is pretty early, right? 
I tend to go to bed about 11 p.m. So I get probably roughly, by the time I get to sleep and things like that, I'll probably get about five hours sleep um, at the moment. Some days are obviously I sleep in the middle of the day, but nine times out of ten, at this moment in time, I'm getting about five hours sleep. So yeah, it's just a case of you know, keep going and seeing the results. I'm currently at 192 pounds. Probably mentioned this earlier in the day. The one thing I've noticed about today was I had breakfast quite early because it was raining. Obviously, it's quite sunny now, but for an England that wouldn't change for a matter of minutes. And it was absolutely freezing cold to the point where I was wearing a woolly hat and my gloves again. So, what I did was I went out with. What's on him with that? Went out with the dog this morning. And started walking, and it seemed nice and bright, not as bright as it, as it is now, but it did seem pretty bright. And then, and then the worst thing happened, it started raining. As soon as it started raining, I was like, no. And so I ended up cutting the walk short because we did it the other day and we came back absolutely drenched. So I cut the walk short and we did only about 3,000 steps where you, or 2,500 sorry, where usually we will do around about anywhere up to 9,000. Back home from the physio. That was painful. He reckons I've got another two, two, three more sessions and the arm should be back to 100%, which is good. Oh, oh. hello, Laws. Hello, Bill. Mm -hmm. There's Laura to say hello. Oh, little princess. My little princess, eh? Um, and yeah, so rest of the night, pretty laid back gonna be well I've just put my food in which is chicken and charlotte potatoes I've got a nice dessert planned oats like porridge and yogurt and pineapple and all sorts and then <laughs> what are you doing what are you, what are you doing what are you doing oh you're a little raj raj packet and I'm going to go on a 9,000 step-ish, about an hour, hour and 10 minute walk to finish off the day. Obviously today's Wednesday, so this is also an update on how I'm progressing in the shred. Um, and yeah, it's generally feeling pretty good. The cold's are starting to go. Um, really it was going, as soon as I got it, it sort of appeared and it wasn't actually that bad. I think it was just lack of sleep that caused it. Um, so we'll see how we get on. See you next time.